So we're gonna do a horse shoe shape graft cut into the meniscus layer that you fold back. And then on the scion branch, make sure the buds are pointing away. And you get here, get me to. Then you cut a wedge shape. Okay, so now you got the horse shoe shape. You got the scion wedge. You peel it up. You fit that in. And it's got a nice skin on skin contact. So you have cells that are there that are being exchanged. Skin and then skin. you want to take your grafting tape. and this prevents water from leaking in. Wait, so what's the problem with water leaking in? Um, it's almost like if you had a cut and there was, it, like, it doesn't allow it to heal. You want, the, you, want, you want it to heal with the graft in, yeah. so it thinks it's a part of the, so the tree. Crazy. It's so insane. And then the last step is I cover it with uh, beeswax. Is it only for apples? Can other trees also graft yeah i think most fruit trees okay i'm gonna do a different type of graft i think up here let me see this back. do right. you are there any examples Here's... on one of the one of your trees where a graft has like taken and grown no this is the first time i've done it oh okay. this so is the very first it. yeah this is the first one no the guy who uh oh actually there is her... i'm sorry there totally is i'll show you the all the baby trees yeah so essentially um Apple, all apple trees are like mutants. And what they do is they have um, really, really strong rootstock. Baby tree, apple trees are um, delicious fruit bearing grafts onto trees that have really strong roots. Oh. So they all, they all hybridize them. It's like an alien using a strong host mother. Exactly. And this keeps the water and weather from interfering with the healing process because essentially you want the graft to heal onto the tree and for the tree to think that the graft is a part of it. Very exciting. These scion branches that I grafted on in the spring have taken here, over here as well and a bunch of other places, which I'm really excited about. Wow, it just feels so cool to do something like this in nature. It's like a science experiment and it's, uh, it's done pretty well. And in the fall, we'll have Honeycrisp apples. for the fastest growing scion graph would be this guy. He grew all the way here and then he shot out all the way from here, 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 all this new growth. This guy is the winner.